Hi everybody, we're gonna do a benchmark assessment. Log into Clever and go to benchmark. When you get to your dashboard, first you have to assign a test. So we're going to the library. Up here, we're going to click on the box and go to the CSAs, Comprehension Strategy Assessment. Choose your grade level. Scroll down, you need to figure out which test you're going to be assigning. Let's do main idea. To assign a test, you click on the gear and then add to assignment. Over on the right, you have to scroll all the way up and do three things. Number one is type in a name. We're going to do... main idea one then you have to choose your students so you click on select class choose your attendance homeroom your students select all done and you have to give it a date so three things name student date Choose today and then choose a date in the future for the end date and save it. All right, that has been successfully saved. That is how you assign a CSA. Today we are going to correct the test that the students have already taken. We're gonna click on benchmark. We're gonna go up to the top to assignments and They've already taken this test. And the green check marks means that they've already taken it. So up at the top, you do grade assessment and you click the purple book under edit. Here you have all of your students if they got the question right or wrong. And sometimes they will have a short answer question. If that is the case, you have to go in and make that correction yourself. Then when you are done, you go up here to share with students. You can select all your students. And then at the bottom, you're gonna share graded tests with students. Her students did really well, very good. Now the students can go back in and see how they did on their own test. After you've shared with your students, then you can go here and look at the report. So over here, it will give you which student, how this, your students scored. And the important thing is that on the left, you have to go to this icon test and you can either look at both of your tests, all of your tests that you've given, or you can uncheck one and just see each individual test. And you will get different results depending on which test you're going to look at. And then at the bottom, you have to go to more students this way. Okay, hope that helps. Thanks.